And then here we are a little later in the day, September 11th. As I mentioned a couple days ago, these horses uh, winter out here and they're wild for about mm, nine months of the year. Up there on the hill, I don't know if you can really see, but uh, you might be able to hear some neighing. Those are the wild horses that we don't need. We only need so many. And uh, these guys here live year round and fend, fend for themselves and you know fight off predators and stay in herds. And we've got probably about maybe 250 head here in total. And uh, yeah, all these guys here, they're they're wild. They've never been never been even been haltered. We've got uh, little baby colts up there from this year. And there's another black stallion right there, that guy. Another mare back there, so not the whole herd's running off on the other side of the mountain, but anyway, just go to show you how we make things work out here. We come out in May and rounded up a bunch of these horses and put a bunch of horseshoes on them here and or trim their feet and then we come in in June and put a bunch of horseshoes on them so they're ready to go for the summer, the ones that we're on here. And then uh, and we keep them around camp and corrals and pens and pastures and all these other guys, they just live a, a happy life. You can see that whole herd up there. There's probably, I don't know, maybe about 15 or 20 of these horses are here year round. Anyway, take care. I'll talk to you later. We're on our way over to Beaver Lake. The river that I showed you earlier where that we crossed was the Shoddy River. And, uh, yeah, I'll show you a little bit later on. Take care. Have a good